Well, after a beautiful weekend, unfortunately, we, we couldn't just dodge the showers forever. This system dropped a lot of rain earlier this afternoon. We see it's part of this larger system. Lots of rotation out to our west. That system will continue to bring us rain even into Friday thanks to all of this rotation. A closer look, though, we will see we've got some heavier showers that are starting to push out. Even heavier showers again pushing right behind it, but luckily we're not expecting anything severe for this evening. Like I mentioned earlier, our high temperatures though, we did get into the 70s, 73 for Charleston though, Paris and Terre Haute, 77 degrees for them. Very warm day for a, an April day in our conditions right now though, have dropped off a little bit cooler in Charleston, 62 degrees, 65 in Robinson, but Terre Haute, they're still holding on to the 70s, but as we head into our evening hours, those temperatures will continue to drop off. Now our winds today Today out of the south southwest, so that's really helped keep us warm as well. Again, we've got double digits in Decatur and also Champaign, 10 mile an hour. Still fairly calm though in Effingham. Those winds will continue to pick up a little bit this evening as that second round starts to push through. So overnight tonight, I have thunderstorms. Again, I'm not expecting anything severe with this, but as some heavier rain pushes through, you could hear a rumble of thunder too out there. 59 degrees for our overnight lows. Those winds out of the south southwest, 5 to 10 miles an hour for the most part. We could see gusts up to 20, so not overly windy, but it still could be a breezy night for us here in east central Illinois. Now, future cast again, we've got the system that's pushing right into our viewing area right about now into the southwestern portion as we put future cast into motion. We'll see that continues to push in right around 8 o'clock, 830, right centered over the viewing area. That's where we're seeing the heaviest showers. Those will continue to push through. And again, it's starting to wrap around from the south. So we will continue to see a little bit of heavier precipitation as we head into our early morning hours. But again, there's just bands of heavy precipitation, not really expecting anything severe with this system. Now Thursday for your conditions, 61 degrees to start off. We'll be left with a little bit of cloud cover in the southeastern portion, but for the rest of us, mostly cloudy skies. You can expect a little bit of a break with the clouds though. 68 degrees by the time you're heading out for lunch, so it warms up very quickly. Expecting our high though, 69 degrees as the kids are getting out of school. And then unfortunately, as you're getting that drive home, that's where we're going to see those clouds start to build in ahead of another round that we're going to see on Thursday. So again, here's those showers pushing out for the first part of the day. But then as you're heading home into the early evening hours, got another heavy band, 6.30 p.m. That's a little specific, but again, right around dinner time, that's where you're going to hear those rumbles of thunder pushing through. Another case of we're not expecting anything severe with this, but heavier rain and you could hear that thunder. That will continue to push out right around 10 p.m. We'll see most of that out, but we will have some lingering sprinkles falling behind that. And that's another thing that you can look out for on Friday. So again, Thursday, high of around 69 degrees, got the thunder symbol, the, or the thunderstorm symbol rather, not expecting anything severe, but we will have some leftover showers with that on Friday. But see this drop in temperature, 69 to 56. So we cool right down with this system. But Saturday, the weekend is looking beautiful. We've got 67 for our high on Saturday. Sunny conditions for our weekend. Get those plans made to be outdoors. It's going to be gorgeous. 67 for Saturday. We bump up even further as we head into Sunday. Back in the 70s, 74 is our expected high. And so as we start the next work week, unfortunately, that's where we see a return of those showers. So our temperatures start to drop off just a little bit.